Sorry to bore you with that, uh, commonly missed places section, if you even actually watched it. So, after playing through the entire game again and scraping every explorable area, going back and doing every mission over again, and visiting every single outpost, you're still missing 2%. What are you gonna do? You may have already guessed what I'm talking about. If you guessed text mod, you're right. I bet some of you were thinking, what a mod? I don't want to get my account banned, that's against the codes of conduct. TextMod is a third party program, so ArenaNet does not support it, but it is not against the rules. This specific mod is not against the rules because you're not actually changing any game files, it just changes the texture of the game, so technically it's allowed, but ArenaNet is not responsible for anything that happens to your account whatsoever, so if your characters all get deleted, which they won't, then ArenaNet isn't responsible, so download TaxMod at your own risk, keeping in mind that there might be Trojan spyware and all that stuff, but it doesn't have any. I'm just saying that so if for some reason something does happen, you guys don't all come screaming at me saying, why didn't I tell you? So I'm warning you right now, download it at your own risk. But I've done it myself, I know several people who have done it themselves, and I don't think there would be a page on the official wiki about it if it was not legitimate. If it had spyware, and I think there would be complaints filed by now, but trust me, it's okay. Nothing is going to happen to you. I promise. Here's how you get text mod. Go to the official wiki, you, you can, which can be found by typing slash wiki on Guild Wars or from guildwars.com homepage, and you can get to the page by typing in text mod into the search. There will be a little thing where it says text mod can be downloaded here, and you click that and it downloads it. And then there's a bunch of warnings and stuff. Okay, once you have it downloaded, you'll need to unzip it. Most computers have an unzipping program or something. You might need to download one. But once it's unzipped, you will get the application will start and it'll look like this. It'll say target application. Click on that little folder thing and select Guild Wars wherever it is in your saved on your computer. Just, then it should look something like this with the Guild Wars thing in the target. Right below the folder you'll see it'll say select packages and then package name. You'll need to download the mapping program thing. So go to the Guild Wars official wiki again and click player made modification and then click UI enhancements. Okay then scroll down to cartographer made easy. It's the second one on the list and then download the map that is the continent you're mapping. Then you click package name and you find the thing you just downloaded. And then make sure that that it's highlighted in the um, select packages box and then click run and cross your fingers that your characters aren't deleted. Just kidding. Once you're in the game then you travel to the continent that you are going to map and hit M and whoa, red stuff all over the place. So you'll see in some places that there are like, there's a red line that lines up with the map, but then you'll see in some places it doesn't line up. Like there's a little clear area where uh, the line should be. So basically, you just go to one of those places, you walk up to an edge that isn't met up with the uh, red line, and watch what happens. and complete it for the rest of the map and there you have it okay it's time for yet another awkward ending 
with me sitting in my guild hall talking about stuff. This episode is more on the informative, educational edge of the scale instead of the funny edge of the scale, but let me know if you liked it, if you hated it, any questions you have, or you can PM me in-game as Doombox. There's two new things that I have for you. I'm going to start doing this new thing where um, every every couple of episodes I have a question answering show where I read some of the questions that I've received from people and answer them. So it'll be kind of like it'll be kind of like this question is from Billy the Slayer and he is wondering how many titles I have or something like that. So you can email all those questions to doombox3 at gmail.com and put your name that you want me to say it's from or put anonymous if you don't want me to read anything. And if you don't want it to be right on the show for any reason, just say that so I don't do that. And also, I have some forums set up. Now they were my guilds forums, but not that very not very many people have used them, so I turned them into the my guild slash Guild Wars video guide thing forums. So the website is www.koe.free-forums.org. So you can sign up for those if you like. I'll have polls and stuff like should my next video be about PvP or armor or something like that and then I'll have a suggestions thread stuff like that so check those out if you have time and that pretty much wraps it up for this boring yet informative episode <laughs>